Well, hello everyone. This is Dr. Peter Sai with Aortic Warriors. Here we're going to be talking about Aortic Warriors Walk 2017. On interview with us is Angie Veda. She is from Scottsdale, Arizona. She's going to be leading a team over there called Team Ray Ray. So, Angie, please tell us uh, why you're leading this walk. Well, in 2015, um, we were surprised by a call we never thought would happen to us. My dad was admitted to the hospital, um, 55 years old. He's a father of four and um, thought he had a heart attack. Um, it was not for a few hours later they identified it was an aortic dissection. So they sedated him, they prepped him, prepped us. Um, a few hours after that, so it probably been like from 3 a.m. to about 11 a.m. before he was admitted to surgery. So there was all that time that kind of, you know, had some adverse effects on his body. Um, he made it through the surgery, which lasted all day. And all day we were studying about AD and realized how rare it was, how misdiagnosed it was. And there's no warning signs, so it can happen at any time, anywhere. People as young as 36 years old are having ADs, and I think when this happened, um, well, let me back up. Dad, Dad suffered a stroke, so it was not the AD that killed him. It was the side effects and the complications of the surgery, and we don't know if that happened in the time that prior to the surgery or during the surgery on and off the bypass, but after 72 hours, he did not wake up, so we started with the MRIs. We learned that he was 75% brain dead, um, and by Friday, he was declared dead. Um, the benefit, I mean, the, the, fortunately, no benefit here, but fortunately, he was a organ donor. So um, the donor uh, network of Arizona came to our side and helped us through the process of helping many others after we knew dad would no longer be with us. So they are an amazing organization. We learned a lot. Our family grew a little bit by all these medical professionals, but the reason we're walking is to raise awareness. Um, I went to get checked, and the cardiologist kind of laughed at me because I'm only 36 years old, and he says, what, what are you doing here? So I told him about Dad's story, and he kind of shrugged it off that it wasn't a big deal. They still didn't look at the aorta. They're only doing the heart. So when they're testing us, they're only looking at the heart, doing CAT scans and, and um, ultrasounds, but nobody offered to do an MRI on the abdominal part of the aorta, and you can't see it. So I think it's important that we not only raise awareness in the community, but to these doctors to educate themselves on the proper diagnosis of AD and aneurysms, um, because it's hereditary, it comes in the family, and it's not predisposed to gender, age, or race. And I think it's really, really important that we get out there. And everybody knows the warning signs of a heart attack. Why don't we know the warning signs of an AD and an aneurysm? So that's why we're walking. Wow. Thank you. That's such a powerful story. And I'm sorry that you had to suffer such a tragedy. Um, and what you said is absolutely correct. The aortic Warriors uh, public campaign is not just the heart. Check your aorta too. Mm -hmm. um, unfortunately, we have to bring that attention to some doctors. Um, we're not here to rag on any doctor. But it's just that if you were to administer the heart attack protocol to someone with the aortic condition, you would They're kill the patient. Sure. Yes. And that's the reason why we're so passionate about this walk and also this awareness. Um, would you like to share some thoughts about uh, or info about how to support your cause or, or supporting your cause? Yeah, we welcome anybody and everybody to join in our walk, even if you didn't know Dad um, or Ray. I have, he's Dad, so um, he would probably be your friend if he met you. Um, so we welcome everybody to come join us. You can, if you can't be here with us locally, um, you can still participate. You can be registered by the 20th. You can still get a free shirt, and you know you can still walk with us, um, but wherever you're at. And, um, or if you can't walk at all, you can um, participate by donating to the cause of the Aorta Warriors and help fund the research and, and grow the awareness of this terrible, silent disease. Yes. Well, thank you very much for your time. 
Um, is there anything else you'd like to add before we close? Um, I don't think I don't think so. I'm just excited. My, my little sisters are super pumped about doing this. Um, one of the little sisters can't make it down from college, so she's going to get a rally of her friends and, and walk with us and flag stuff. So okay. we just welcome everybody and anybody to join us. Whether you know us or not, we'll eventually be family. Um, it's a support a cause that can affect your family, too. So Yes. Awesome. Let's well, do it. Yes. Our, my son is uh, also in college, and he's going to lead kind of a rally, just like you said. Um, so we'll put – just make sure she takes some pictures, and we'll okay. put all those uh, pictures together in our video. Awesome. Well, welcome to our walk. I'm really excited. And uh, welcome to your first time. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. All right. Bye-bye. Okay, bye.